Today's video is egotistical, or more egotistical than normal, because um, for those who don't know the origins of Disgruntled Danny, so I've just realised the, the origins of Disgruntled Danny, this would be the worst Marvel film ever made. Disgruntled Danny, we need a man who gets upset and angry about trivial things. I'm here. Now, the way this channel started was I used to post little videos to Facebook and a few friends liked it and said, why don't you do a YouTube channel? And this is it. And it isn't big or successful, but I didn't expect it to be because um, I'm a fat middle-aged bloke who gets angry at things. But if I post a video and it gives one person a laugh or pause for thought or to see things a slightly different way, then that's good enough. But recently things have um, changed somewhat. Not much. I mean, first the second batch of these, the disgruntled Danny shirts, they all sold out and that has amazed me. And a few times now, I've been recognised by people who only know me as Disgruntled Danny. And that's a nice warm fuzzy feeling, except for one where I was uh, actually stood at a urinal and a bloke next to me went, Are you Disgruntled Danny? And I went, Yes. Although in my head I was thinking, Could you not have waited till I put my dick away, you fucking weirdo? What I should have done is just wipe my hand on myself going, Yeah, nice to meet you. But this is a cautionary tale for anyone who's thinking about doing anything like this on YouTube or whatever medium you choose to use, uh, if you have any sort of online presence, even absolutely minuscule like me, it's like having a magnet. Uh, do you remember the Roadrunner cartoons where Wile E. Coyote would have a big magnet, he'd turn it on, and suddenly there'd be a safe or an anvil or something could smash into it? Although thinking about it, surely the magnet would have moved because it's path of least resistance and all that. Fucking education on Disgruntled Danny. Bit of science there. If you're recognised at all online, it's like having a big magnet. But it doesn't attract ferrous metals. It attracts fucking lunatics. In effect, I am now a nutter magnet. Every half-wit and crazy and psychopath with access to a keyboard, that's all of them, will want to get in contact at some point if you do anything like this. And I know I do invite some of it, because I do like winding up the flat earthers, because I like having an argument with someone who can't understand gravity. Uh, but uh, I did a video a while back about gun control, and straight away, death threats! Death threats from people arguing they should be allowed to keep their guns. Um, I'm saying that I'm not anti-gun, by the way, it's just, I think, more restrictions. Uh, so, yeah, it's... Whatever you do online, be aware, every fucking whack job out there will want to get in contact with you just as they want the attention. Um, and remember, the internet is like one big asylum and we've all got fucking access to it.